Aftershocks continue to rattle the lower North Island and the upper South Island following a powerful 6.5 magnitude earthquake centred 20 kilometres east of Seddon. 34 shakes were reported between midnight and 6am with the largest recorded a 4.9. GNS science seismologist Stephen Bannister says the initial earthquake that struck just after 5pm released energy equivalent to 100 nuclear bombs and was bigger than the devastating February 22nd earthquake that hit Christchurch in 2011. The Wellington region suffered damage as emergency services cordoned off streets including the Wellington City Council building. The object of the exercise is to ensure uh, everything is checked and the city is safe and secure for usage throughout. And we've got traffic management out, we've got, as I say, senior officers around. They'll bring in specialists if necessary to look at anything that may require uh, expertise assessment. Footage quickly emerged following the quake, which captured the moment Wellington was shaken. Supermarket aisles were left splattered with products, while this futsal match between New Zealand and Australia was interrupted. Well done by Ashby Peckham. A heck of an earthquake going on as we're here. And we have, and we have to stop. The fire service was kept busy with more than 60 call-outs, including the rescue of people trapped in lifts. The city will now begin the clean-up of fallen debris while train services have been cancelled with no bus replacements, expecting to make the commute difficult.